everybody here in Spiritual Biz Success. Kimberly Masca here, your fearless leader. And uh, here's something I've been hearing a lot lately, which is really interesting because we know the big awakening is here. We know it's time for everybody to be stepping out. But then this little thing called fear comes creeping over your thoughts. And a lot of people I keep running into lately, it's like, I don't know if I'm ready. I keep hearing this over and over. They're like, I just don't know if I'm ready. Like they want to take the step. They're thinking about taking the step. They're curious about starting their spiritual business. But then they keep saying, I just don't know if I'm ready. And I've got some news for you. But you're actually not ready. And you're not ready because you haven't taken the steps to pull it all together to make it happen, which is why you need a mentor. But yeah, a lot of you guys, you're not ready. And that's okay to not be ready. But the point is to get ready, to be there, to be able to step out and say, yep, I got it. And you know what? It's going to be scary. And a lot of those little fears are going to creep in. Can I do this? Who am I to do this? Should I be doing this? What's the family going to say? What are my friends going to say? I know all those fears keep creeping in, but I gotta tell you, who cares? Who cares what they think? Who cares what they're gonna say? There is a world of people out there that are in pain, that are waiting for you to step out with your spiritual gifts. They are looking for guidance. They are looking for someone to help shift them. They are looking for someone to help them over the hump of whatever they are going through. And that person is you. That's why you have these gifts that you have. You're in this group. You are primed and ready with gifts that you've received from source. And now it's just about getting over your own fears to be able to step out as a spiritual leader. So if you're afraid and worried and hemming and hawing about things and thinking, I don't know if I'm ready, I'll confirm that for you. Let's get rid of that fear. You're right. You're not ready. You're not ready until you have a mentor to guide you through the whole process. And then you're ready. And that's the key. And so a lot of people have their, what they, you know, they think is a spiritual business. They're calling it a spiritual business, but it's not quite a spiritual business because they haven't taken the time to have the right mentors. That's why when I see people struggling with clients, they say, how do I attract clients? I can't figure it out. It's like, well, if you haven't invested in you and you haven't invested in your business, how do you expect clients to invest in you? How do you expect clients to give you an energy exchange of money if you haven't invested in yourself and your business. So then that actually makes your fear about stepping out and being ready greater. You're like, I don't know. I don't know if I should be charging or how much I should be charging. And it makes everything just kind of fall apart. And then your fears get bigger and bigger and you start to think more and more, maybe I'm not ready. How do I know if I'm ready? Well, it's a choice to be ready. But it's also a choice to find someone that can show you how to be ready. So you're right. You're not, if you're not working with the mentor, and I see a bunch of my clients in here. So if you're not working with a mentor already, and you're not getting the guidance that you need to be able to step out, to have the certainty, to have the knowing that you're supposed to be out, to be able to have the business foundation so that you can do an energy exchange with your clients and have a real business. If you don't have someone guiding you through all of that, then you're right. You're not ready. You aren't. But find that mentor. It could be me. It could be anyone. doesn't matter who it is. Find the mentor to guide you through the process so that you can get out there and change the lives that you are meant to change. That's why you have the gifts that you have. That's the whole point of it. That's also why you've had the experiences that you've, that you've had. If you've had these like life-altering experiences, the reason why they happen is because you're supposed to be teaching them. You're supposed to be writing books about that. You're supposed to be out there letting people know that you can survive those things. That's why you've gone through them. And if you're doing anything but taking those lessons and going out there and sharing them with the world, you're missing out, man. You're missing out not only on helping people, but you're missing out on your purpose. You're missing out on the calling that you have, that Source has given you to go out there and to change lives. You are missing it if you aren't doing it. You know what happens when you miss it? You live an average life. No one wants to live an average life. You want to look back and be like, what did I do? I should have, I could have, I would have, but I didn't want to because I was too afraid. Are those the words that you want to say at the end of your life? I don't think so. Those aren't the words I want to say and I'm not saying because I am out there and my clients are out there doing amazing, amazing things. I see Stacey Overman in here who's been doing incredible things with her business. She's graduated boot camp and mastery. It's amazing. So if you guys have a gift, I know you have a gift. That's why you're here. What are you doing if you're not using that gift to change consciousness on this planet? You're going to end up living an average, mediocre life 
that's not serving the planet if you don't get over the fear of, I don't know if I'm ready. Because I'm telling you, you're right. You're not ready if you don't have a mentor to get you over those humps and to show you everything that you need to be able to step out and serve on this planet. So to get you ready, I've created something called Spiritual Biz Leadership. I will put the link above. Spiritual Biz Leadership is the piece that's going to help you get ready to get ready to get out there to create an amazing business that will shift consciousness on the planet. Link's going to be above. This is for those of you who had that fear because there's five characteristics of a spiritual leader that you need to have in place to be able to step out. So you're right. If you're sitting in that fear, you're not ready. Let's get you the mentorship that you need. That is spiritual biz leadership. The links above It's a six month monthly program, six month program where you will go through all the elements of being a spiritual leader so that you can be ready and remove the fears and the doubts and all those things that are keeping you in an average mediocre life. We're going to get you ready to step out and change your life and change lives of others. Link will be above. Let me see if there's any questions. I don't believe there are. Stacy's in here. Hey, Teresa. All right, guys. Link will be above. Do not live an average life. You were not put on this planet to do that. It is time for you to step out and change lives everywhere. Spiritual biz leadership is the first step to get there. I'll put the link right above, and I'll see you guys in the next video.